Hi, Drew Embry with PL Technology here, and we have a quick video tip for you today. Business moves faster every year, and it's always great to let someone like a client, vendor, or prospect know that if they email you, that you're out of the office, let them know when you're going to return, and what they can do to get help in your absence. Setting your out of office setting in Outlook does a great job of this. But what if you either forget to set this before you leave, or you have something come up, like a meeting that runs long, or a situation where you have to go pick up a sick kid on short notice? In the past, it wasn't possible to set the out of the office setting from an iPhone, but with the introduction of iOS 8, this is now possible. And we wanted to show you where to set this as it's not readily apparent. If you don't already have iOS 8, you'll need to upgrade to do this, but most people probably already have iOS 8. So what we're going to do is we're going to find our settings icon. That's the little gear here that says settings below it over to the left of the screen. We're going to click settings and that'll take us into our settings. We're going to go find mail uh, contacts and calendars and click that. So we see that there uh, about right in the middle of the screen. And then we're going to look for our uh, exchange account. So whether that's our local corporate exchange account or our Office 365, it's going to say exchange. And you see that there towards the top of the screen. I'm going to click that. And then down at the very bottom there, you see automatic reply is off. I will click that. I will set the little slider to on. And it'll allow me to craft my message where I can put my details when I'm returning. So I'll go ahead and add a little uh, bit here. I'll just put see you. Okay. And I'll click the save button in the upper right hand corner. And that's it. You can see the automatic reply is now on. And when anybody emails you, uh, they'll get that message. You can also turn it off from here, or you could turn it off from your PC. That's all we have for you today. Thank you for tuning in, and we'll see you later.